G'day, in this episode we say farewell to Master Chef Paul, surfed our cat sideways for a bar crossing, and launched a cat over waves. We went bike riding around Camden Haven, and we got Zara into a routine. Hello, this is Heidi, Zara and Josh. We decided to pack up and send it, adventuring, sailing, catching, and cooking our way around Australia. We recently sold our hobby farm, said farewell to our sheep and land life. Follow us on our new adventures on board Sailing Catamaran Pacific Star. Recently we sailed into Port Stephens and went out to celebrate for our first main sail. We walked up the steep Tormarine Mountain. We highly recommend this walk. Dara, do you know where our boat is? Oh. There she is. Thumb begins walking all the way bloody down. It was our last day with Paul, so we took a walk along Hawks Nest Beach and went for a swim. Later on in the evening, we visited the homegrown markets and got ourselves some fish and chips. Is that yummy, sweetie? Yeah. Popo made a good choice of fish and chippies. Thanks again for all your help, Paul. We'll miss you heaps. It's 5.30 in the morning. How beautiful is this moonlight? Living on a boat without a car comes with its daily challenges, but it's all part of the fun. Got a 20 minute walk back to the boat. Let's see how far we can milk taking this trolley. <laughs> Overshopped like usual. Are we going to go on an Easter egg hunt? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are we catching today? Crabbies. Go on, Malcolm. Malcolm Douglas catching us food. Who was the other guy who you mentioned? Alvin. Still don't know who he is. Yeah, that's disgraceful. Mm. Where are you taking us, Sarah? Doesn't matter. If I was a mind reader, I'd be a millionaire. You're a crew member. It means that it's 24 oh. hours a day action. Just There's catch no me some crabs. There's no rest. Catch me some crabs. How many crabbies are there, Zara? One. Two. But how awesome is this sunset? That one's It's so cool. <laughs> it's so cool. Yeah. Another job getting done today. Joshy ripping out the aircon. How much do you reckon it weighs? Oh, uh, 40. Potentially, we're moving like 80 odd kilos out front. That's awesome. Zara? It wasn't your fault? Yeah. Well, how did the toilet paper end up in the toilet? The whole toilet roll ended up in the toilet? Yes, and I can't close my fish, but not my net. Yeah, that's where it's supposed to be. Yeah. Nice and close to the beach. Hopefully we don't end up on it during the night. But the serenity. Farewell Port Stevens. Sailed up and we're just heading to a nearby island to start heading up to Port Macquarie. Stay tuned. Okay. Yay! The boat's a bit rocky so we've got to sit on the floor while we make them. Doing a good job there sweetie. If you do anchor here, try to get the mooring close to shore. Otherwise, with the southeast trade winds, expect a bit of a rolly night. Buddy's weather report. <laughs> Look at this. This looks like nothing, but my Fitbit didn't even recognise a sleep pattern because I was up so much last night. You ended up in mummy and daddy's bed. I sleep as a baby. You know you did afterwards. What can you see, Zara? 
<laughs> so we arrived at Crowdy Head. Had a local who helped us tie up to a jetty. Pretty surgy coming through there, but we're here, aren't we? Go yay! <laughs> we tied up on the wooden jetty in front of the co-op. With a few line adjustments, we had a good night's rest. I think it. Go to the pub without dad? Yeah. Okay. Girls trip? Yeah. High five? Woo! Police on the east coast, they know how to fill your glass. Basically to the brim. Winning. The following morning, Phil invited us over for a cuppa and Zara loved feeding his dog treats. We took a stroll up to the lighthouse and it had a magnificent view overlooking Crowdy Head. And we got prawns from the local trawler and I made a pizza. Bar crossings in New South Wales have to be timed correctly with an incoming tide. We think that because of the rain we were getting in the area, the tides are later than usual. After one failed attempt due to a huge crashing waves in front of us, we decided to wait until it was looking a little bit less hectic. From morning walk. Where are we today, honey? Somewhere. Hayden Haven or Dunbogan? Hamden Haven. It's and beautiful. It a little towns Dunbogan. on this little inlet. Train and water, young. Done a good job there, honey. <laughs> Day for laundry. Three huge tubs worth. You're doing an amazing job. Keep going. Are we going for a morning power walk? Yeah. Beautiful. Have heaps of fun. You did. Thanks for being wearing bikes. Here comes our rescuer. We didn't want to walk back four k's. Two boat down there. You're my hero. <laughs> Was that a fun walk? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Farewell Lorrington. So that's the sign to say this is dangerous, this bar crossing. And it's compulsory to wear a life jacket. But today, no problem. No problem. Thank God. It's very fun. Yeah. Yeah? Explore Port Macquarie. I have to get a sail repair job. Oh my god, they're massive. You're actually doing work. First night sail almost completed. We will be having a beer when we get to the end. Peace out, Ellie. Thank you. Hey guys, Heidi here. Quick disclaimer about the channel. Yes, there's an occasional swear word. At the beginning of our journey, a lot of the content was filmed off my iPhone capture family memories hence the youtube channel now future content has improved we've upped our game in the meantime we hope you enjoy our adventures thanks for the support have a good one